In this video, we're going to be looking at solving linear equations. Plus times plus gives plus. 2 times 2 gives 4. Minus times plus gives minus. Minus 2 times 2 gives minus 4. Minus times minus gives plus. Minus 2 times minus 2 gives 4. Okay, here we have x plus 3. This is an expression, but in order to make it an equation, we have to have a balancing scale. So we can have equals, less than, greater than, less than or equal to, greater than or equal to. But we're going to be looking at equals. So here we have x plus 2 equals 5. What we're trying to find out is the value of x. x is our variable. So in order to make x on its own, we have to move the 2 across. So we minus 2 on both sides. So we get x equals 3. We can check our answer by substituting this 3 into the x. Three plus two is five. So indeed this is correct. Let's look at this. Two x plus five equals fifteen. We want to move the plus five to the other side. So we minus five on both sides, giving us two x equals ten. And then we want to get this two to there. So we divide by 2 on both sides. x equals 10 over 2. And we can simplify this to 5. We can check our answer by substituting the 5 back into the x. So we have 2, 5, plus 5 equals 15. 2 times 5 is 10, plus 5. And 10 plus 5 is 15. We know our answer is correct. Let's look at this. 2x plus 50 equals x plus 20. This is similar to collecting like terms. We want to make all the x's together and all other variables together. So we want to move the x there and we want to move the 50 there. We'll do this step by step. So. In order to get the x to there, we minus by x on both sides. So we get x plus 50 equals 20. And then we want to move this 50 to the other side. So we minus 50 on both sides. So we get x equals minus 30. We can check if our answer is right by substituting it back in. So 2 minus 30 plus 50 equals minus 30 plus 20. 2 times minus 30 is minus 60. And minus 30 plus 20 is minus 10. We can simplify this to minus 10. So indeed, we are correct. Let's have a look at this. We want to find the value of x. We can simplify this straight away, so that's what we will do. Equals 10. We want to multiply by 3 on both sides. So we get 2x equals 30. And we want to divide by 2 on both sides. So x equals 15. And we can check it by substituting it back in. We'll multiply by 3 on both sides, and we can simplify at the same time. And 30 is indeed equal to 30. Okay, I would like you to try these questions. Press pause and have a go. When you're ready, press play. Here are the answers. I've also given you the answers for the simplified version. 
Okay, hopefully you are confident on solving linear equations. If this video helped you, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe.